Hey everybody, this is Representative Lori Pohatsky and I just wanted to touch base about next steps uh, after what happened at the Michigan State Capitol last Thursday. I, I've heard from a number of constituents as well as my other colleagues that we need to reassess the policy around open carrying of firearms in the Capitol and in our offices and I couldn't agree more. Uh, you know, normally these policies are in place until something bad happens and I think that last week is the extent of what we need to see in terms of something bad happening. The intimidation tactics that we saw uh, really were concerning in terms of what could happen if things had escalated any further. So it's imperative that, that we uh, reverse those policies. The other thing that we need to be very uh, concerned about is uh, the health of not only legislators, but also the, the law enforcement that was there and was trying to mitigate um, you know, any escalation. We know that there's a pandemic right now, uh, and we know that the people who had packed into that building were not socially distancing. Many of them didn't have masks. There were no health screenings at the doors, like the ones that all of the legislators uh, took part in, making sure that no one was running a fever, that they hadn't come in contact with anyone who had COVID, that they hadn't had COVID over the last two weeks. None of that happened for the people who entered the Capitol. So if we are going to have people coming in uh, to protest and to uh, you know, observe their government, which is their right and is something that they should absolutely be doing, we need to make sure that they're doing it safely and they're not putting each other, legislators or law enforcement at risk. So there are a number of things that we need to do moving forward in light of last Thursday. And uh, I'm, I'm here to voice my support for those policy changes and I hope that you'll join me. Thank you.